This is the Late Round Podcast with your host, JJ Zacharisa. JJ Zacharisa. Sell Derrick Henry. Yeah, I know, guys. I talked about Derrick Henry last week on this show, and Derrick Henry went absolutely nuts against the Chiefs. Now, to be fair, I did say the following in my 15 transactions column last week. I said, it should be noted that Tennessee gets Kansas City this week, creating a good matchup for Henry on paper. If you want to wait to sell him, it's understandable, but Henry's value also will diminish if he doesn't perform. So hopefully you waited because Henry finished the week with 33 fantasy points. That gave him his third top 10 performance in his last four games. I know a lot of you are probably saying this is when Derrick Henry really pays off. Maybe that's true. But I don't buy into narratives like that. I think those narratives get you into trouble more often than they don't. The truth is, Henry's continued to outperform in the touchdown column even more than he has historically. As we all know, touchdowns correlate strongly to yards. The more yards a player has, the more touchdowns he usually scores. Now, context is always needed with that type of analysis. But Henry's yardage total tells us that he should have 3.4 fewer touchdowns than he currently has. Now, speaking of that context, players in good offenses can outplay the simple yards to touchdowns conversion. But let's not pretend that Tennessee has this great offense. They've scored 30 or more points just twice this year, and even when you only look at games that Ryan Tannehill has started, the Titans have been completely average in yards per drive. And that includes Sunday's performance where they looked decent against Kansas City. And as I mentioned last week, Derrick Henry is not even seeing that many high leverage touches. Through week 10, he's had six goal line rushes. That ranks outside the top 20 in the league. And then to top it all off, we know he's not involved that much as a receiver. He's hit a single game target share of 10% or better only twice this season. Now the Titans have a bye this week, so if you need to win now, Derrick Henry is a good sell candidate. But I think he is even if you need to win later as well, because in the fantasy playoffs, as I mentioned last week, they get Houston and New Orleans. That's in weeks 15 and 16. Those are two tough matchups for an opposing running back. 